democratic to me. I mean, we, we voted it down. We don't want that budget. Well, the people have spoken, but it doesn't seem that even matters. Tonight in Avon, a new budget will be adopted, despite the majority of voters saying no. Channel 3's Dylan Fearon is live in town to break down how this is even allowed. Dylan. Aaron, this is a big deal. Voters have rejected three budget proposals in Avon. There's a provision in the town charter that says if the budget does fail three times, the council can just do whatever it wants anyway. Some people in town feel that's just not right. And I think that it's going to force a lot of professional people to, to move. Jay Duxon could be one of them, a physician in town. He loves Avon. 20 years here, but at what cost? They're going to ignore the mandate of the people after three votes, three, you know, pretty significant votes, and they're just going to come up with, with whatever number they want. And that's what council plans to do. A 22 year old provision in the town charter allows council to adopt a budget after three failed attempts. So even though the majority of voters said no to the budget, Council will adopt it anyway tonight. 23-year resident Paul Rowland isn't happy. Uh, but the people don't want it, and to have the town council just go ahead and rubber stamp it, I don't think is, is right. Houses in town were recently reassessed. Many people's property values increased. That means higher taxes. The town spending an extra $5.3 million compared to last year's budget. That's significant in this small town. You know, I, I think a lot of people, they don't like it. They're going to have to move. I, I may find myself in that you know, in that uh, uh, camp as well. We wanted to give the council every opportunity to respond to furious residents. Town manager Brandon Robertson refused to go on camera tonight. Only one of the five council members got back to us, but only spoke over the phone, saying most residents may not have voted because they trust council to make the best decision for the town, hoping to avoid a budget war. Paul's not buying that. Here's my checkbook. I trust you to spend it however you like. Yeah. Uh, I don't, you know, I don't agree with that. I think that that's a, that's a little pandering right there. I don't, I don't agree with that at all. But I, I think there's a certain level of arrogance, you know, that, that's occurring right now and a kind of like, you know, where we're in charge and, you know, we know better. Yeah, Mark and Aaron, mostly silence from the council today. The meeting's right behind me at 7 o'clock tonight. The budget will be adopted, and those tax bills will be mailed out to residents in about a week. We're live in Avon tonight. I'm Dylan Fear in Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Dylan, thank